my man. Who is your man? Ah, shut, sir. Come. What has come over you? You will soon know what has come over me. You went and stabbed me behind my back. Yet you ask me what is wrong. You yes. asked me what's going on. What is this now? What, what is this? that no man or woman should fight each other for a boyfriend, girlfriend, fiancé, whatever, when they are not yet married. I mean, if anyone breaks your heart, there are a thousand and one single people out there who are looking for a heart to mend. Me. Jachiki involved in a fight because of a woman. How did I not see this coming? Please, I'm looking for a young lady that lives in her uncle's apartment here. I've been trying to call her a couple of times, but she's not picking up. Though I spoke with her about an hour ago. And you are? Her friend. Okay. Um, Ogechi stepped out like um, 30 minutes ago. She told me she was going to the market to get stuff for, you know, she wants to make food for her friend that's visiting from Enugu, so. That's me. You? Yes. Oh. Okay, nice. I, I guess she's still in the market then. Yes, she is. Okay, thank you. Please, can I get somewhere to sit? I'm really tired. Oh, oh, sorry. Sorry. Did this for the fun? This will do. Thank you. My God, he's so cute. Dark, like hot chocolate. <sighs> Just imagine how he's. This is my first time of visiting Port Harcourt. Have you always lived here? Hello, sir. Have you always lived in Port Harcourt? Oh, sorry. Were you talking to me? Of course! Is this not obvious? Sorry. <laughs> Are you always this serious? I mean, really focused on your task. I love focused men. Oh, well, 
Yes, I have lived in Port Harcourt all my life. And um, no, I am not always this focused. So, is this your first time of visiting Port Harcourt? Yes, it's my first time. So, um, a friendly visit or? No, I'm actually planning a wedding that is going to take place in the next three weeks. My client wants to wed in Port Harcourt. I'm a well-known wedding planner in Enugu. I came highly recommended and I decided to give it a shot. Just hold on. You're planning a wedding that's happening in three weeks' time. And this is your first time of coming to Port Harcourt. I mean, who does that? I'm not just starting the planning process. I've been planning for the past four months. I've done all the necessary reservations and payments. Come on, you know this is the era of phone and videos. Oh you know these things. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> oh my god, sorry, I almost forgot. Well, um, name is Jachi K. I'm Nena. That's a nice name you have, Jachi K. Thank you. Do you know the meaning? Of Come on! <laughs> I know the meaning. Uh, well, just in case you don't know the meaning, it means appreciate God's work. <laughs> <laughs> You know something, uh, Nina, right? Yes. You you have a way of making people laugh. That's my job. Oh. <laughs> I am paid to make people happy as nice. a wedding planner. Nice. And it's a passion. Okay, so um, how about we go inside? Uh, I can get you something cold to drink while you wait for your friend who bitch. Sure, why not? Thank okay. you. Thank you. I'll, I'll take the bag. Thank you so much. How are you? I'm very well. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, so can I drop you off at the Thank you so much. That's so nice of you. I already called a taxi. Okay. So what's your day going to be like? I mean we could have a chat later in the evening when you come back. <laughs> hmm. Should you not say can we have a chat over dinner? <laughs> okay, so you want to teach me how to toast, right? No, I am only suggesting. <laughs> All right, okay. I will show you the stuff that I'm made of. I'll be waiting. You know, I'll be here for the next three weeks and I'll be free most evenings from 7 p.m. 7 p.m.? Yes. Okay, so we can start um, with the dinner.
dinner is fine. We'll have dinner in your house on your dining table because I will come back with fresh fish to make jollof rice in your kitchen. Fresh fish and jollof rice. Uh -huh. Sincerely, I can't remember the last time I had that. So <laughs> fresh fish and jollof rice is a go for me. Okay. Um, I'll be back later, um, say 6 p.m. That's fine. See you then. All right, no problem. Um, I'll be coming over with Ogechi so that you don't get overtaken by my beauty. I am already overtaken. <laughs> See you later. All right. <laughs> Will not spoil your day. It cannot. What happened? You know, I have an important presentation to make this morning. Really? Yeah. So, have you tried the back Yes. Okay, you pick it and see. Nothing. Nothing, man. Okay, so, um, how about you just get your files and Join me in my car so I can give you a lift. Brother, you are a lifesaver. Anytime, man. Car. Anytime. You're doing here all by yourself eating alone because the angel doesn't need a company okay the food is on me no strings really okay I just ordered for five bottles of beer look at your face <laughs> I was just joking I don't even drink alcohol you got me there, you know. Mm -hmm. Do you mind if I? Okay. 
Okay. Thank you. So, what was it you're afraid of? The fact that you're gonna pay for my beer or that I was gonna drink five bottles? <laughs> to be honest, mm -hmm. it has nothing to do with the payment. It's just that I've watched with disgust the increasing rate of alcohol consumption, especially the youths. You know? And the movies promote it. So I thought you were one of them. <laughs> one doesn't necessarily have to drink alcohol. You can have a drink. Okay? I think um, someone needs to educate the public on the effects of alcohol consumption on the body system, especially the liver. You know, like the kidney, the liver is just one. You know? And the liver cirrhosis is a direct effect of alcohol consumption to the liver. Yeah. I think uh, if they know exactly what this alcohol consumption does to the body, they will have everything. Hmm. So, this liver cirrhosis you just mentioned, does it have a cure? No, it doesn't. It doesn't have a cure. Oh, that's sad. Even the, the, the high rate of consumption of um, codeine and smoking. It's... You've noticed that too? Of course. I feel very uncomfortable. I Me? Mean, it's crazy. Sorry, you haven't ordered your meal. Oh my goodness. You know, I totally forgot. Who wouldn't sit at here talking with an angel? Waiter! Here's my card. Okay. Well, that's oh, yeah. cool. Yeah. I hope to see you again. We'll see about that. Just so you know, I had a nice time talking to you. Enjoy the rest of your day. In all our discussions, Nena never for once mentioned Ozoma's name. I did not even know they knew each other. The three weeks she was here was like three years to me. We discussed as if we had known each other from Adam. I never feared to crack any joke or say anything. She understood me and I was so sure I found a soulmate. When she left, we continued to communicate as if she was here. Every day was nothing without her. We grew so fond of each other. I had a conference in Enugu scheduled few months after her departure and had intended to pop the question when I went there. I wanted to surprise her with that visit and just propose. But then, coronavirus came and the conference was cancelled. Little did I know that Ozoma was also in a relationship with her. She is so outgoing, free-minded and innocent. She never knew she was dating two friends. Two friends that are like brothers. There's this girl I've been seeing, you know. We've been dating for some time now, and I want to pop the question to her. Ozoma. Ozoma, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. You want to settle down? Yes! I want to settle down too. Are you serious? Yes! As a matter of fact, there is this sweet heart of mine I want to propose to, you know, and she's um, in any way. I, I wanted to go there. You know, surprise her, then do the needful, but lockdown came. Oh, wow. Then we, we have to fix our wedding on the same day. Well, that's a good one, though. I, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. But, but, hold on. 
I hope you're not trying to make me get my food, you know, get drinks, get hauled, and you just come with your bride and say, I do. Hmm? What are you trying to say? <laughs> well, even if I'm going to do that, I'm going to be doing it for you. Because all those your village people will come hungry. Oh. Trying to devour everything that is oh. left. <laughs> okay, okay, fine, you win. But seriously. I had hoped that you would be my best man. Yeah, sincerely. You know what? I actually thought about the same thing. Are you for real? <laughs> but don't worry, we can always find alternative. Okay, yeah. We will find alternative, but um, our ladies need to meet. Yeah. True. You know, I don't want our relationship to go so far. We've had, you know, situations where the ladies just come into the picture and the next thing, they are ruining lifetime relationships. So I don't want that to happen. Exactly. That's you, know. you are right. I think they should meet. Um, well, anyways, um, In fact, you, sir, you get to see my own babe now. Wahala, no, no, that's not a problem. Um, congratulations in advance. Congratulations too. Bro. At least I'll have to drink your, you know, your your drinks. And you eat my food. Uh, it's one one. Yeah, one one. <laughs> nice. Hey, baby. I was just about to sleep. I'm so sorry. Sorry about it, baby. No thanks. If it wasn't important, I wouldn't have called. I'm getting What happened? It's not like it's very serious, though, but... I'm just confused. I'm really... I'm in love with Jachi. I'm with him. I'm always thinking of Jachi. This thing God love me. <laughs> hey God. Love one thing. It's not the same thing that happened with me and Emeka. I waited for him to talk to me. To propose for two good years. Only. Two years. Until I saw his wedding invitation. And when I confronted him. I said, no. Dear mama, who knows if he's seeing you more like a sister too? Sister Kwa, to fear Kwa. I broke one gate to fear Kwa. Brother Kwa. I really love this guy. Why will he not talk now, eh? Grab your man. Eh? Who after your heart? Who got the Rosiqua? I got these long stories that touch the heart though. Oh, my signs are positive. Just for him to talk. Just talk. <laughs> Come for him now. They don't allow this other guy to, to distract you. Well, try and pray. Oh, pray. Allow God to take the lead. You go. Okay, thank you. Good night, huh? Oh. And good night, eh? Sleep well.
So, what would make Uzoma to lay his hand on me? My childhood friend that I can die for. Don't let it break. I know it is safe with you. My love, will you marry me? No. No, I can't. Why? I can't. I can't. No, wait, wait, no. Hold on, wait. I love you. That's why I traveled all the way from Potako to Enugu to propose to you. I didn't want to say it over the phone. Uzo, you're a good man. What? What? I'm in love with someone else. You are in love? With who? You've never spoken about any other man. And I've not seen you with anybody either. I know. He's not here. His name is Jachike and he lives in Potakot as well. Wait, wait. Did I hear you say Jachike? Mm -hmm. I hope it's not who I'm thinking. Do you, do you have this picture on your phone? Why do, why do you need this picture? No. No way. Jataki, you can't do this to me. Do, do you know him? You stabbed me behind my back. stop to think that he did not even tell me the name of the lady he was dating. Neither did I mention my lady's name to him. We were both innocent. And Lena was 
innocently having her fun without knowing that she would land me with a broken arm and no Zoma. Lost it. If only Uzoma had laid anger aside and discussed with me man to man. We would have discovered that none of us wronged each other. There is always power in dialogue. There is always power in laying anger aside and hearing from the other person. Your preconceived ideas may be wrong after all. Never conclude too fast. Hello, my love. Hi. Why did I think I was dealing with a gentleman? No, baby. I'm sorry. I mean, how could my own friend stab me behind my back? Uzama, when you say stab you behind your back, what do you mean? Did he ever know we were dating? You see what I'm saying? How could you be dating two friends without letting us know? There you go, Uzoma. I never knew you guys knew each other. Both of you never knew either of you were dating me. I am a single lady shopping for true love and keeping my options open. So why should I tell any of my clients about the other client? Did I just hear you say client? Of course. So if I may ask, and if you would be honest, Uzoma, I know. Was your anger justified with Jachike? How can you lift up your hand against your own friend? One week or so. But why do you ask? That's not what I mean. I mean, how long is it going to keep you here? <laughs> I'm sorry, T. I've just been slow today. It's been a very long day for me. Well, I'll pray for maybe an hour, then I'll go. Why are you looking at me like that? No, standing like you're stressing yourself. You're overworking yourself. For the past few weeks, you've been working on double shifts. And even before then, you still stay out late. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I would have said you're doing all this because you need extra money. But I know you now. That's not the reason. Tina. I am fine. Hmm? I'm okay, by God's grace. I'm just doing my job. Your job is to be a nurse and nothing else, nothing more. See how stressed you look now? You see your eyes? They don't have bags under them. You look so stressed. Just relax now, relax. You're my friend, eh? I'm also my co-worker, and I'm not worried about you. I think about. 
want you all the time. I'm really worried. Okay. Tina. I know I'm your friend and you are worried about me. But trust me. There is absolutely nothing to be worried about. I am fine. I stay back to take care of these people because they need it. See, most of them don't even have families that come to see them. So they really need all the love and support they can get to go through this. I know, I know. Yes, I know. But you know Jesus. And you can't be there for everyone. Yes, I am not Jesus. And I cannot be there for all of them. But I can be there for some of them. And I am determined to do just that. See, see. One good change at a time makes the world a better place. Everybody said that somebody would do all the good things that nobody did. Everybody said that somebody would do all the good things that nobody did. Exactly. Don't worry, I am fine, okay? Don't worry. It's okay. Just try and rest. Okay, so it's my fault now, V. No, not my fault now. No, let's not even go there again. Okay. But seriously, bro, yeah, I I want to really commend you for forgiving me. I I like the fact that we handled this uh, maturely, you know. Well, it's it's not a problem, bro. I mean, how can we just ruin our friendship just like that? It doesn't make sense to me. Yeah, it doesn't. Mm. And then I was so careful not to sleep with any of us. Guy, that babe, eh? That babe, eh? A genius she be. You She's a she genius. She is. Ah! Guess what? She hooked me off with her friend Ogechi. And this Ogechi behaves like her, talks like her, and acts like her. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. The thing is, yeah, um, Ogechi, uh, she's been a wonderful neighbor to me, like a very good neighbor to me. Yeah, and I, I must tell you the truth, that girl is well-mannered. She's a wife material, so I am actually happy that you found someone you love. And I'm even happier that the person you're about to get married to is someone that will not, you know, affect our friendship sincerely. Yes, yeah, so I'm happy. Truly. She wouldn't. Mm, she wouldn't. <laughs> she wouldn't. Well, congratulations. Thank you, man. <laughs> and I must congratulate you too because her saying no to me is an automatic yes to you. Well, you can see that again. <laughs> mm. By the way, will you be coming for Chief Inkinga's birthday party? Oh, of course. Of course I will. And this time, not alone. Nina said uh, a big yes to me. <laughs> a big one to me. <laughs> Congratulations, man. Thanks, bro. Thank you That's so much. That's good news. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and of course, I won't be coming alone either. I don't have to be left out. <laughs> I'm coming with Ogechi. Oh, she said yes too? Yes, she did. Oh, okay. Nice. Nice. Of course. Nice. Because we're drinking, don't say so. Uh, uh, yes, we will, but I mean, the mechanic is not done, so. All right, we we'll uh, just have to wait a few minutes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Please, please, please. 
just stop this your your religious attitude of yours, please. Just stop it. Eh? What are you doing with my man? I mean Jachike. Jachike? The last time I checked, Jachike has neither asked any of us out. You expressed your desire in him. I've been longing for him to talk to me. Even though I did not tell you, so I made the first move. Since you are only wishing to. Oh, 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 wait. So all this why you've been secretly admiring this guy. Eh? You traitor. Is everything okay? Yes, I'm yeah. fine. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm fine. You know, let this stop. Yeah, fine. Okay then. Um, the manager said you should uh, treat these files.
I'll think about it. Did you even listen to all I've been saying? Still, I said I'm happy, and I'll think about it. Let me go back to the board. Hello. <laughs> Nena, yeah, what's up? Okay, yes. I told my friends about it and five of them have accepted to come for their training. But he told me you have five years already now. And that will make you ten. Don't worry. <laughs> You'll be on course. No need to worry, okay? Thank you. All right. Take care. Bye. What do you have to do? I thought you're done with your prayers. So what else is keeping you here? Actually, I finished with one yesterday, but I added two more to the list. I was even about to go pray for them before you walked in. I also cooked for them this morning, so I need to wash up my pillars. You cooked? And you didn't even tell me. Come on, it wasn't for me. It was for the patients. Okay. I'll add a plate for you when making tomorrow's fudge. <laughs> <laughs> That's a size thing. See, I'm looking forward to eating your delicious meal. Mm -hmm. You know you're a good cook, right? And I know you're saying all these things because you want to eat food. No! <laughs> <laughs> it's true, Joe. Okay, okay, it's fine. You caught me there. It's fine. <laughs> all right, so see you. All right, now, take care, okay? That's true. See? Daniela, Babo's best friend is single and he's looking for a girlfriend, hopefully to get married soon. So I told him about you and he really wants to meet with you. Please, please, please. Can you go on a date with him? Please. Please now. But why do we have to do all these things? We don't really have to do anything. But from one friend to the other, I just think you should try this out, okay? Please. See, he hasn't dated Ida. So I think you both can hit this out. Please. Yeah? Okay. I'll consider it. <laughs> but only because he's that boy's friend. And the that boy I know is a nice man. Thank you. Thank you so much. I promise you, you won't regret it. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. So now, off you go. I'm going, I'm going. Okay, bye. bye. Don't give my in-law waiting. Please, please, don't forget my food. I won't. Say me hi to him. I will come with you. Bye. Tina, every day is Monday. Monday, Monday. I mean, how can someone not see the good in front of them? How can? I have done everything to attract this man's attention. Am I not beautiful enough? Am I too old? Why can't he notice me? I do my work well. I don't have time for all those nonsense in the office. I just faced my business. 
Am I not a wife material? I'm a wife material. I'm a wife material. Because you didn't sound happy on the phone. Why? Oh, were you shy to tell me how much you enjoyed going on a date to him? Yeah. I wish that was the case. Like, honestly, I really wish that was it. So I'm assuming it went badly. That is such an understatement. This man had absolutely no manners. He was unkept. Do you know the worst part of it? He came in drunk. Oh, no, no, no. Sell me your lie. Ah! I wish I was lying, my sister. I really wish I was lying. I almost don't want to talk about it, so please just. Seriously, Sibanula, I know you're upset, but please, I would really like to know how it went, please. Please. Okay. No problem, I'll tell you. <laughs> like I was saying, he came in drunk. I didn't even know he was drunk until he spoke to me. Plus, his eyes could hardly focus on anything. Why would you do that? No. I don't even want to know. Anyways, at first, we were having a conversation and it was going well. Up until the food came. Do you know what he did? He stopped talking and started eating his food. Then he finished his own and asked me if he could eat mine. Are you serious? Please tell me that didn't happen. Ah, uh -uh. it very much happened, my sister. So, did you give him yours? I did. I didn't want to cause a scene. He kept eating and talking. I couldn't even hear most of the things he was saying. I wasn't paying attention anyway. Not until we asked. If I was really a nurse. You, you mean Olamide asked that? Of course he knows you're a nurse. He knows we both are nurses. Calm down. You're so impatient. I answered and said yes, I'm a nurse. Can you imagine what this man asked me? Seriously, I don't, I don't know. This whole situation is wider than my imagination right now. said, can I make him come and take care of him? That it had been a long time someone did that to him and he had forgotten how he felt. At this point, I had no reply. I just quietly stood up, paid for my food, which he ate, and left. You mean he said that? Intensely shy or lamide? He did. Anyways, I had drink and give little courage. 
wine is a mocker, strong drink a brawler. But whoever is led astray by it is not wise. Proverbs 20 verse 1. Mr. Domula, I'm so sorry this whole thing went horrible. I'm so sorry. It's fine. I could hardly even concentrate during the whole situation. I just kept thinking of my patients, wondering if they are fine. I, I just wish I put in all this extra hour taking care of them instead of doing this, if I'm being honest with you. I know, I know. I'm so sorry, okay? Me too. I wish you didn't go. It's so fine. Okay. I'll just take it as a sign that right now I need to concentrate on my patients and take care of them instead of doing all this. I know, mean, listen. Hmm? I know this whole bit went bad, but the truth is, one hard egg doesn't mean the entire crisis. Hmm. I know that. But you see, all of this. I am not repeating it, not any time soon. Celestine, I'm really sorry it went like that. But honestly, you need to have time for yourself. If you read the Bible, don't you think Jesus wants us to love ourselves first before loving others? Like the Bible said, love your neighbor as you love yourself. Aha! Uh -huh. Pastor Tina! <laughs> Tina is quoting the Bible! Yes, my sister! But, but that's the <laughs> So, 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 am I still going to have my food? Tina, you need to get going. It's late. Please. Plus, you kept my in-law alone at home. Please. He's in love, please, now. You will get your food. Please. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I hope it's not because of food you came here. No, no, no. Why? Why? Enjoying myself this hey, way. Hey, hey, hey. Me and now. I got a nice too. You see me. Ah. Well, it's not me. It's mm -hmm. my friend that got married. Ah, one of my closest friends got married. And the wedding was a bomb. The celebration was all over the place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the girl spends money like crazy. The girl. Yes, so she got married to her junior colleague at the workplace. She has been admiring this guy for the past two years. The guy no one show workings. <laughs> she did her personal investigation and found out that there was no lady in this guy's life. Wow. She asked the guy out. The guy was shy. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Please. But I hope this guy really loves her, shall we? Ah, the guy fell flatly in love with her. In fact, the guy loves her like hell. But the only thing there is just that Akudo has more money than this guy. But that man does not matter at all. Ha, just hope. Oh. Wait, oh. the guy did not contribute to the wedding. Oh, he, he contributed, Sha. But the thing is that the guy wanted the modest wedding, now you know. I could have wanted an elaborate wedding. Wow. So she lavished her money. Hmm. I beg, I beg, waiting for me. As long as they love themselves, that one will be waiting at the think of. Now myself, I they think of now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Get this guy who I don't do admire. <laughs> <laughs> This me. Hey, this girl I don't the admire for the past one mm -mm. year. Hey, I go shoot my shots. Are you serious? <laughs> and if you walk, I will marry. These are big.
should I even wake up so late to date him? Eh? And of all days, my girls decided to finish to date. Oh, wow. If not for the filling station that opens 247, I would have just been stranded. Hey, getting a car by this time is always very hard. And I have to walk down to that, to that bus stop. Let me just be going. Sure, she'll be okay. She'll be fine. I told you yesterday. Yes, I know I know you did, but as you can see, she's still unconscious. Eh? She's still unconscious. Her vital signs are stable, so she'll wake up soon. <sighs> see. You don't have to come here anymore. You've done enough bringing her to the hospital. No. I will come here every day until she wakes up. I don't mind. Listen, us. I don't want anything to happen to her. I won't forgive myself. Nothing is going to happen to her. She'll be fine. Okay. I, can I at least wait? Wait until she wakes up. I want to see her wake up. Please. I insist. What's my dabby? Uh, I'll, I'll need you to call me when she wakes up, no matter the time of the day, midnight, early morning, any time. Just call me, please. See, I might not be on duty midnight if she wakes up. I know, I know. But you will definitely know when she wakes up. So I, I want you to call me, please. I need to see her and apologize properly to her, please. <sighs> but you don't have to. I insist, I want to. I want to, I insist. Please help me. Please. It's okay, it's fine. Um just hand me your phone so I'll put my number. Okay, thank you. Okay, please. Okay. So you send me a text message okay. with a name. So I know it's important. Okay. Thank you. I will do that uh, right away. So, so what? Well, what's the name? Um, Mr. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I, I have to get going now. Please, I'll be expecting a call. Please. It's okay. Yes. <laughs> let me, let me, let me rush off. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Please, I'll be expecting a call. Thank you so much, right? I really appreciate it. Uh -huh. um, but see, 
not like I don't see your, your signs, your green lights. I, I see them. But uh, I am sorry. I'm engaged. Are you engaged? Engaged to who? I haven't seen with anyone lately. Well, um, she doesn't stay in for targets. Uchechi. You're a very beautiful woman. And you have a good heart. And I pray that you find somebody that will love you. Listen, um, but here, yeah, it's a no. I'm taking. Sorry.
Daniela. Oh my God, Daniela. Can you hear me? Daniela, can you hear me? Oh my God, Daniela. Can can you hear me? God, I have to move this. Daniela. motor accident and you've been unconscious for some days. <gasps> sorry, easy, easy, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry. So okay. I'll be fine. Tim, I can't feel my legs. Sorry, just relax. Stop, 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 relax. Sorry, sorry. Just relax, relax, don't move. the road then oh my god I just relax how long have I been here tonight was going to make it three days but so far you've been breathing well so we did not need to put you on life support yeah Sorry, sorry. No, no, you can't, you can't. Just relax. Relax, you'll be fine. I See, I sorry, sorry. I think I, I need to call the doctor, okay? I'll be back. Just relax. Okay. Why can't I feel my leg? I'll be back, okay. Let me just um Take care of my baby. 
ateşimiz kadar yapın size. Kuvvetimizin üstteki kağıttı. Kuvvetimizin peşiniz. Is she really awake? Would I have called you if she were in? Oh. Just um, follow me, okay? She's with the doctor. After that, we'll see her. Okay. Let's go inside. Okay. Did you go? The doctor said I need to do an MRI. What did you saw about your leg? He <laughs> said that the estimated recovery time is about six months. That I have a fractured tibia. Mm -hmm. So this will stay for a very long time. Yeah. I'm so sorry, okay? You'll be fine. I'm mm -hmm. sorry. Thank you. I wish you speed recovery. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. Someone is here to see you. Yeah. Is that my patient? My in law is here. That boy is it? That... Then who is it? Um, this is Mr. Harry. He's... Um, Tina. Uh, is this some kind of joke to you? For Christ's sake, I am in the hospital for an accident I had. And all you could think of was to bring a man here. Oh, it's, it's not what you think. It's not what you think. Even, even brought flowers. It's not what you think. I, I... Then what is it? Okay, it was my car that hit you. And I brought you to the hospital. And I asked her to let me know when you gain consciousness. Um, at this point, I'll be outside. In case any of you need me, okay? You're the one responsible for this accident. Responsible? I beg your pardon. I'm not responsible. Breaking my bones with your car. What do we call that? Uh, my dear, if you had watched where you were going, maybe I wouldn't have hit you. What? Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I don't want to argue, okay? I'm really sorry about this, okay? I've made sure to take responsibility for everything. I just need you to forgive me. That's all I'm asking. Forgive you? Yeah. For what exactly? For landing you in the hospital. Uh, of course, this is not what you planned for today or any day. So, I just need you to forgive me. I'm sorry. I truly am.
I don't spread grudges. So I forgive you. Wow. That's a relief. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Um, maybe I better get going. Okay. Let me go home and uh, maybe I'll see you tomorrow. There's no need to come back. Not tomorrow. Not any day. Goodbye, Miss Daniel. Point of correction. Nos Daniela. Baby, do you think your parents are going to like me? Of course they will. I mean, <laughs> I packaged you well. Packaged <laughs> you? Are you serious? <laughs> but you know I don't need packaging, Sha. <clears throat> I'm a perfect gentleman. <laughs> a perfect man? I see. What, 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 what's the meaning of that? No, speak up. What, what does that mean? Am I not a gentleman? Really? You want to get me started? Okay. Is it a fact that we both did not take breakfast this morning? <laughs> because you bought the two cups of rice we're going to have this morning. Or oh, the fact that I always remind you of your appointment. Is it the... Okay, okay, okay. You win. You win. <laughs> But at least you know what you're getting yourself into. So that whenever you want to travel, you have to stock the fridge with food so I don't burn your kitchen before you get back. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Do 
you know when they'll be here? Okay, she said in 30 minutes. 30 minutes. Okay. No, but babe, seriously, my parents will love you. I mean, my mom texted me a while ago saying that she's done preparing okazi soup with Abura Pepsi. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Do you know the last time I had that was last Christmas? You see, I've told you, you need to get mother. I mean, there are some things you don't just grind. It's in the pounding that the oil comes out from the ekusi. You need all these things. Baby, who's gonna be doing the pounding? <laughs> no. So that's actually your problem, right? Yeah, we have to. <laughs> Hello, Mama. Just um, my knees and a choice. Mm. <laughs> so, young man, what, what do you do for a living? Actually, um, first of all, I want to thank you for this warm welcome you have given to me. I really appreciate it. You're welcome. You see, I love your daughter here so much. Mm -hmm. and I will move a mountain for her. I will go an extra mile mm. to prove to her that I love her so much. <laughs> Babe, he did not ask if you love me. He said, what do you do? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was carried away. You say I am an architect. So I build houses for companies and individuals alike. So I have my own company. That's nice. You're welcome. Yeah. Uh, nice one. You're welcome. This number has been bothering me since I... Excuse me, ma'am. I have to take this. Go on. Go on. It's Jachi. Okay. Hello, Jachi. What? Where, where, where are you now? Okay, I'll, I'll be there. I'll be there shortly. I'll be there. What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? It's Jachi. He said oh. Nina just had an accident. Oh my goodness. What happened? They're at the hospital. My best friend, ma. At least I have to go now. I think he needs me. Okay. I'm sorry, sir. It's okay. It's okay. We have to go now. It's okay. I think there was a little water. Is that okay? Drink some. Okay. Drink some. And then just drink some. And then just drink some. Be careful. Be careful. Thank you. Mr. Henry here. Zina. I am very sure you saw him walking away while you were coming in. So why are you asking me that? <sighs> look at these flowers. They look so nice and they lighten up this place. Yeah, right? They're really nice, I must confess. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Tina. <laughs> Uh, that reminds me. Do you know two of my patients came to visit me today? Really? And guess what? What? 
they are getting discharged. Mm. Are you serious? Yes. <laughs> wow, that's good news. <laughs> yeah, honestly. I can't even believe I've been here for some time now. <sighs> I feel so confined. If I have to move, I need to use the wheelchair and then ask for assistance. Tina, do I really deserve this? Even after being kind to others. Hey, you don't say that. You don't say that. We blame God even without looking the road before crossing. See, I don't want you to be in pain, but the truth is, you've added a little bit and you look fresher than before. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I needed to hear that. <laughs> yeah. And um, you've met Henry. At least that has to count for something. Tina. Yeah. See, that man is incredibly thoughtful. He comes here every day since the day of the accident with food and flowers. And he also wants to be close to you. But you don't give him the chance. And he also wants to be friends with you. But you don't give him the chance. He doesn't deserve that. So what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to praise him because he brings me rice and chicken? Or am I supposed to bow down and worship him because he brings me flowers? Come on. I don't even know who I'm talking to right now. Tanela, you know this is not about rice and chicken. That man has no obligation to come here the way he does. See, his only duty was to bring you to the hospital and pay the bills, which that's, that's all he needed to do. But he comes here every day with food and drinks that he doesn't really need to bring. Tina. At least, at least, just be a, bit, a little bit nice. Tina, he put me here. Have you forgotten that? So, how am I supposed to be happy with him? Daniela, you and I know that somehow you have a part to play in this accident. You're always busy thinking about your patients and what you're going to do for them. And most times you forget about yourself. Wow. So, I don't know, but the chances that you did not look well before crossing the road, it's high. <laughs> Just wow. So now I caused the accident. You know that's not what I mean. What are you saying? You know that. Okay. You are only human. And all human gets tired. God has designed us that way. You need love. Every human has a breaking point, Daniela. Tina, have you forgotten what happened with Olamide? How am I so sure that it won't happen again? So listen, you've been in us for nearly 10 years and you've seen the most horrific stuffs and you still continue. It's the same with relationships. That's why it's advised not to wash in so fast. Listen, Daniela. You must give love a chance. Give love a chance. I've, I've had all you said. I will think about it. I said I will think about it. It's okay. It's fine. Uh, okay. Can I? Please. Even when I'm very so. Into the, the tree. See, 
all I can say is, glory be to God. I mean, what would I have done without you? Just. What is important right now is that your life for me. The wedding can wait. We can always get a new date, okay? Just relax. We came as soon as we heard. Oh man, thank yes, you so much. Okay. Thank you. Are you in pain? Yes, I'm fine. What really happened? Thank God. Listen to these stupid bad words. Thank God she can even stand. It's a comfort to us. I tell you, bro. I tell you. We were really worried. We had to leave every other thing we we're doing to get here. Oh, man. Thank you so much, man. Problem, hey, brother. Problem. Thank you so much. Thank you. Something to the world, I guess. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry, yes. Hello, Jachi. What's up, bro? Do you want me to tell Okechi to come exchange with you at the hospital so you can go home and get some rest? Oh, that's good to know. Okay then, go home so you can get some rest.
at this particular juncture, we are going to put our hands together as we call the cultural dancers to mount the stage. Put your hands together as we welcome the cultural dancers on the stage. As we welcome the cultural dancers. Somebody make some noise! Hey! Hey! Thank you. I hope we'll get you going to look like this in the next three weeks. Because you're so beautiful. Mm -hmm. Definitely. We'll get you will make a beautiful bride. Whoa. I'm so happy for you. Thank I'm you. happy for her too. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's time for the bridal entry. Let's wow. go, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Please, go Lugi, go Lugi.
also inherited it from their own forefathers. My daughter, you told me something uh, in the closet. With this drink, go and bring us that man you want us to involve into ourselves, my daughter. Go, we send you. Malaysia money. Hey! From the inside of me, as a father, uh, today I pray God Almighty and the ancestors of our land, they will keep you people long life. You people are blessed. You will live long to see your great grandchildren. Yes, Wherever you men put your legs into my son and my daughter, it shall be well with you. Yes, Everything from today will obey you people. All this we pray in Jesus' name. Yes. Let the music play. I am a very happy man. Yes.
Of course, you. There's no other person in this room. Come on, why do you look so surprised? I should be. <laughs> you know, uh, when I come here, you hardly answer my questions. Talk less of you asking me questions. <laughs> wow. It's so to say, I should be surprised, don't you think? <laughs> well, <laughs> okay. I know I've been upset because you put me here. But I've also thought about it and I realized I was also at fault. So I forgive you for real this time. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Appreciate. Appreciate. But I must ask though, what are you doing here by this time? How do you mean? You're usually here between 2 to 3 p.m. So I figured that's when you normally take your leave from work. Oh, this is almost 10 a.m. and you're here. Yeah. It's unusual. Well, um, I took the day off from work today. So I could spend some quality time with you. Really? Yeah. Uh, wow. <laughs> That's really nice of you, you know. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs>
your idea of spending the day with me is pressing your phone? <laughs> maybe you could tell me about your, you know, maybe your work, your family, anything. Just start from anywhere. Mm -hmm. For you. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> is this how prayers are answered? You know, I'm fasting today, and I told God that if you are the one, when I come here, there should be obvious change of attitude from you. Oh, wow. I think it's Jesus. Hold on. <laughs> so, wait. You mean you pray to God about me? Yeah. Serious. Wow. Well, I also told God that if you're not the one, when you come here, he should make you do something that will make me dislike you. But instead, I... I like you. <laughs> I like you more. Really? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Why should I even fast till 6 p.m. when my prayer has already been answered by 10 a.m.? No way. You're fasting till 6. You fast till 6. In fact, uh, till 9 p.m. No, fasting, of course. It's a lie. You're fasting. It has the answer. Come on, you have a very good sense of humor. Honestly, I've not been this happy in a long time. If you give me the opportunity, you will not regret that. Mm -hmm. What opportunity are you talking about? Shaped in a good looking cross, it's back off the woodwork. Danger's not gone yet, Bernardo Silva shot deflected behind. You know, I used to play for Chelsea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, that's a decent ball. Oh, it hit Havertz. And then he dropped the two. Hey, baby. Huh? You need to get sharper knife, so. Uh-uh. You know, as married women, now we need to make cooking easier for us. Oh, let me see the knife you're using. Uh-uh, no, now. I'm bad. No wonder. I have sharper knife. Cherry. Sweetheart, what's up with the food? We're starving. That was a good one again. It's early. Oh, the words keep it going. Good looking cross. It's back off the woodwork. Danger's not gone yet. Baby, be, be fast. Well, Bali might have to go long here. He played it short into Kukure. Right. Chelsea determined to play their way out of the trouble. Out, so. They've ended it, giving it straight to Kevin De Bruyne. It squirms mm. off Kepa. I'll make do with this till whenever they're ready. <clears throat> Whoa. You're gonna kill yourself, bro. Take it easy, man.